Hey guys, I'm Paige, and we keep buying to you and saying we're done with Loot Crate. Well, we um, we're only doing if the subscription box actually sounds interesting to us. Like what was the last one? Um, it was the villains, villains number two. two. Mm -hmm. And I'm glad we got it because they had Los Polos Hermanos Locos. Um. Uh, apron, and I couldn't think of what it was. That would be awesome to get like the whole cast to autograph it. So now, um, I wanted it. I kind of wanted it, but I didn't care if we missed it or not. But this month's theme is time. But Loot Crate is a geeky subscription box. They send you a monthly subscription box for geeky items related to a theme. Mm -hmm. And this time it is also perfect because it is the anniversary of Back to the Future. It Which was a couple two of days. days ago. Yes, because um, you guys remember um, October 21st, 2015 was at when Marty McFly... At 429. Yes, at 429 was when Marty McFly came to the future and I still don't see self-tying laces or hoverboards. Well, they, uh, Michael J. Fox actually tried the first pair of self-lacing boots That's or shoes, cool. whatever. And it is also special on my channel, my first ever Loot Crate video on my channel, because this item is time travel, not just back to the future, but also something from Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure, dude. Great timing of the clock. And yes, yes. We survived past 6 a.m. Oh. Uh, took me a couple seconds. Okay. Also, now, um... Loot Crate has a new thing, one extra thing, it's called Level Up, you get, it's, um, either you get two pairs of socks, which is kind of stupid, for the girls, you could get, like, an item, an accessory, like a wallet, sometimes it's wallets, jewelries, jewelry, or, like, scarves, stuff like that, for, that's for more for the females, and then, um, females, girls, or those guys that would like that kind of stuff, mm -hmm. we don't. Uh, we don't, we don't judge. We don't don't judge. judge. But could, um, they also um, have, and well, also shirts, mm -hmm. jacket or shirts, hoodies, and uh, they say it doesn't. Um, it's not the same thing you would get in a box if you get a shirt from the box or a piece of jewelry. It's not the same thing. Mm -hmm. But let's get to it. It will have information in the link below or the description below. I kind of cheated by accident, so I know something. Ooh. Which this is something. is what. I saw, Ooh. or well, I didn't see it, but I heard about it. Him with the goggles on his face this time, and he's not really in his. I'd say, I yeah, but he has some power plug things, electric thing. But I should just keep this in here and have Christopher Lloyd sign it. That'd be awesome. I, I it makes me think of like, I don't know, like the '50s version of him. I think it is. So that's, that's, that's cool. It's like a variant of them. It's not the exact same Doc Brown we already have. Let me see. It's a Loot Crate. The whole box is all Loot Crate Yeah, exclusive. it is. This is the older, you know, well, from the past version with the thing. and. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Okay. Um, I like it. You want to do the next thing? or? Well, I'll check out the shirt because it looks like I feel something. like that's going to be This might be the Bill and Ted Ooh. Ooh. thing. Ooh. I well, see the on. other thing first, I want. Let me, let me say ooh first to mine. Yep, there we go. Be excellent to one another. What size did you get, though? It's probably large. Why your size? Not I don't well, know. No, it's extra large. That's my size. Okay, well, that's cool. So, yes, be excellent to one another. And party on, dudes! And, of course, this is where Keanu Reeves had his big thing. And I don't know if he did anything before that. But I'm already cheating. I'm already looking at the box. Oh. Mark is too slow at looking at the box. I'm admiring this shirt. I mean, I have not seen a Bill and Ted shirt ever. I'm glad I got the box. Okay. This is the thing that really came out to me. I wish I had my little replica hoverboard, hoverboard but to compare. And it looks like an authentic one. Hmm. With like a certificate of authenticity. This document certifies the one... Fifth scale replica of the Back to the Future 2 hoverboard is created by Quantum Me Mechanics mm -hmm. under license from Universal Pitch exclusively for Loot Crate. So, that's pretty cool. So, let's look at it. Uh, eee, look! Oh my gosh, it actually. Oh, I lost something. This is going on my display case for sure. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's so awesome. It looks like it's hovering. 
that's so cool. Got it. I wish I had my actual hoverboard to compare it to. Let me see. Oh, that's so cool. Even has a little hole where the thing snapped off because it was originally like a like a girl thing, and Michael Jeff Fox took the thing off and became a hoverboard. It was board. like a scooter, scooter, really? scooter hoverboard, but pretty cool. Hmm. I don't know where that came from. Oh, I guess it wrapped around that thing. I don't know. That's pretty cool. That's awesome. That is. That's one of the, like the most coolest, most um high quality things that we ever got in the Loop Crate Nerf Block or any of them boxes. Okay, now I'm happy that we got it. Mm-hmm. Whew, I almost be dropped careful. it too. Yeah, let's be careful of that. I would cry. You always saw me cry. But that's pretty cool. Now you're sucking up and trying to show off your chest and shirt. Okay. <laughs> oh well. I am going to look at I want to pull out the next one too. Okay? What do you, pull what out do you the even next do? I just I got my shirt from Bill and Ted. That's the way I wanted the Bill and Ted item. Sonic hey. Spork. <laughs> A little crate exclusive. I'm so curious about this. I saw Oh my gosh, it's so awesome! Look how cool that looks! Oh, so oh my gosh, it's a sonic screwdriver. And it's a spork. Land more be jealous. That is pretty cool. That is pretty awesome, actually. Hmm. I can make my friend jealous. <laughs> Maggie, there you go. See? Be jealous. Be jealous. Well, does she also get loot creeks? No, not anymore. She uh, canceled oh, it. Oh, she's going to feel bad if she missed this one then. That is pretty cool. I, I have to admit that it's pretty awesome. And mm -hmm. it's, it's good metal. Things, so it's not plastic. Well, this is plastic, mm -hmm. so you got to be careful with that one. But that's pretty cool. Yeah. So, so far, do you consider this probably one of the best crates we've gotten ever? Yeah. Even though I'm not a fan of Doctor Who. Which I'm gonna try to watch it. I found it on Netflix and I kinda of, I really am curious about it. But I've been slacking, I've been watching everything else like Pokemon. Yeah. So I can help you with that one you get anything. <laughs> <sighs> that is pretty cool. So well the shirt what does the shirt say anyway? I forgot. The be excellent to one another. That's one of the little things they say during the uh, movie. So that's your gift, that's for sure. Yeah, we got it on Netflix, yeah, so uh, we should yours. be watching that soon. Loot Crate official member looter number. So what does this do then? Nothing really, to be honest with you. Mm -hmm. And uh, the, the flux capacitor makes time travel possible. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, one time Paige was trying to fix the sink or something and she slipped and it hit her in the head and that's what she got the idea No, of she, he had to fix the clock there and he go. slipped on the toilet. There you go. Why was the toilet? It was a, I think it was a toilet and I, he was standing on the toilet to hang it up. Oh, okay. And that's where he came the idea for time and travel. And that's pretty much it. Oh, this is a thick um, book. Is there anything in like the engravings? Yeah. Oh! Oh, God, yes. Party on, dude. This is another Bill and Ted thing. And it's kind of hard to see because you're looking at, I'm looking at this from behind. But it's like basically Bill and Ted and all the people they bought from history. Let me take a quick look here if you guys remember this. Yeah, we got Abe Lincoln there. We got Socrates, Billy the Kid, um, Socrates? I don't know. Billy the Kid, Genghis Khan, Napoleon, Joan of Arc, um, what's his name? Um, Sigmund Freud, all them people. Oh, this is so cool. This is such a good memory. And then the funny thing is in the curtain here, you see that the DeLorean is like peeking, like kind of hidden behind the curtain. And the Doctor Who um, phone booth, the TARDIS thing is hidden behind the thing. That's so cool because this is like their school play announcement when they were introducing all the time people. That's a pretty good detail. I like that. That's probably... Okay, well... The book, you know, mm -hmm. the usual. They're, they show you how to make the costumes. I know how to make the Marty costume because I cosplayed him a couple times at different conventions. Mm -hmm. And these costumes are so easy. You get them at thrift and, stores. And your pick here. So you can see the infamous pick of you posing with Doc Brown and Marty McFly. Or at least very good, you know. Um, I forgot what I was saying. And it's easy to get his costume. The 2015 version is a little bit tougher. I think you have to make that one. So, just like 
information about the doctors? Or who is your doctor? Yeah, I don't really care about that. It's like a little flow yeah. chart thing. Mm -hmm. But that's pretty much it. And then little information like about level up stuff, how to get it. What's what's it so much about? Yeah. Oh, uh, future imperfect. What we received. Hoverboards, kinda. Jaws 19, no. Drones in common use, yep. Flat screens and lots of TV channels, yep. Slang like Bojo, Lobo, and Tranks, no. Biometric ID, scanning eyes and fingerprints, kinda. Um, fax machines, no. Video games play without using your hands, yep. Personal tech used at the dinner table, yep. And flying cars, it's kinda. Yeah. But yeah, and then it tells you about the different um, items, but you know that. It's not very many items in here, but they're all exclusive stuff that are pretty epic. So I I, I think it was worth the 20 isn't it $25 or $20? $20? Something like that, yeah. $20, $25. I haven't looked at the website lately, but that was, it was worth the money. So I, if you didn't get it, that sucks. Yeah. But yeah, this is one of the best crates you've ever done. I gotta say, you get exclusive Doc Brown. It's not, it's not the same one you get in, at, at Hot Topic or whatever. It's an exclusive one. You get the even. Cool. Oh look, he even has a scar from whenever he hit his head. Yep, and of course you get the hoverboard. So Replica, yeah, this is the, awesome the I mean, 1955 version. Mm -hmm. Yeah. If I, I can only get Christopher Lloyd to sign it, now that'd be my dream come true. Yeah. So I'm um, gonna get to wrap up this video. It's pretty cool. Again, there's more info on Loot Crate and the new level up thing below. You can check out the links and stuff. It's a pretty cool thing. And like Paige said, uh, we're not gonna buy it like like you know, faithful like we did before. But unless if, it sounds good. Yeah, if something cool comes up, then we'll get it. You know. And yeah, that's basically it. Oh, one cool thing about Loot Crate, they also gave us a free trial for Crunchyroll, which is pretty awesome. So you know, you never know. We'll keep checking stuff out. Maybe. Maybe we'll get level up sometime. I don't know, but I will probably get the shirts, but but that's the most expensive option. That's plus your loot crate ex um, subscription. So yeah. remember, it's a plus, like nine ninety five, fourteen something, and maybe twenty. I don't remember how much it costs anymore. It's been a while too. Yeah, but but yeah, thank you for watching. Um, anything else? Um, that's it, guys. See y'all next time. Um, uh, um, if you have any suggestions, there oh, there's a whole bunch of different geeky subscription, subscription boxes, boxes anymore. Really so, like tons, yeah. So we'll see what happens in the future. We don't know what's going to happen. Our destiny or our future. Our future is. I don't know what he says, but whatever. <laughs> yes, we'll see y'all next time, guys, and hopefully. Where we're going, we won't need roads. That's heavy, Doc.